keep an eye on these two guys, Marquise Bell mm -hmm. and T.J. Vasher, the wide receiver, 6'6", out of Texas Tech. Right. He spent all last year on uh, non-football injury. Uh, he had knee surgery, and uh, you just look at his look at him. He's always open, right? He's six six. Just throw it up, and he had a catch yesterday that got a couple wows from from everybody. <laughs>
you know uh especially when he's sitting down he sits down real good he has some some impressive agility and he finds holes pretty well uh and i like that uh and i'm gonna show y'all his production and stats but the problem right there is he got very little separation and that's one of those things that i think is gonna follow him to where he's not gonna appear open a lot but he's the type of guy that's always open like mickey says because he's six six he's a big target so it's almost like trying to out rebound lebron you can be in his hip but he coming down with that rebound he's a big target so he's one of those guys and i love his agility to be that big you know so as you can see that's an easy touchdown he got inside on that slant round and he made swiss cheese at that corner um but yeah he has very very big radius but as you can see uh even when he makes these catches a lot of times those guys are right there in his hip and like this route is clumsy like i'm watching this out that wasn't a clean break and that wasn't a smooth out the corner was right there stride for stride easily but still that's not his advantage as a super good route runner his thing is going to be size and catch radius and being able to box you out so he's somebody that should be interested with that big catch radius as a red zone guy and the metrics really bear that out when you look at his total production at tech you see that that's where he was really standing out as an athlete you can see that his athleticism showed up more so his athleticism showed up in the touchdown so if you look at him from a career standpoint 21 tds that's smoking it all day um but what's crazy is his best year was actually 2018 like just his totals that's where he really was at his best so you could almost say it's been a long time before mr tj has been the man he's been quiet coming off of that injury so a lot of us are very curious of what is this sleeping giant going to come with but i think it's pretty obvious that mr tj done put in that work he's obviously put in that work uh you can see that he put in, putting in the work because his name keeps coming up through multiple sources so i'm excited to get my eyes on him i can't wait till i'm able to attend these training camps because i'm gonna be going to the california training camp as well as obviously the dallas training camp and i'm gonna be able to give y'all a first-hand view of what is the hype really real or not and that's one thing y'all know when i look at it i'm gonna tell you the truth i'm not gonna give you no kool-aid i'm gonna measure it uh, i'm gonna make sure that it's exactly what the hype is real but i do like that his name is being called that is a true indication when you seeing his name keep coming up through multiple sources so um, y'all make sure y'all stay with boss cowboy sports and like this content it's really important that y'all hit that like button super important that y'all hit that like button because that's that's what's fueling our growth y'all coming into the videos and y'all liking it even if you don't donate obviously we want you to donate every time y'all donate it helps um, it goes to more equipment and different things that we're upgrading. We obviously appreciate that. We appreciate the super chats. We appreciate the thanks and all everything that you're doing. But uh, the last thing I want to say is we really do appreciate this growth. We really do. And it's coming from y'all. It's coming from y'all sharing this. I'm looking at y'all sharing on Facebook. I'm watching y'all share it on Twitter. I'm just watching all the different groups y'all sharing the content in and it's getting a lot of growth y'all are truly fueling the growth of boss cowboy sports so i i easily see us hitting ten thousand at this pace by december or maybe november at the latest january that's if we continue at the rate that we continue in it if y'all continue but i i just want to make sure that uh because i keep hearing his name i want to make sure that i did a breakdown on tj so that we don't forget the sleeping giant so y'all stay up and that's boss cowboy sports where your voice matter peace